Hey folks, and welcome to this intro video to Dfang, a radically simpler way to build, deploy, and optimize production-ready cloud apps. Let's get you up and running with your first app. So first things first, you're gonna need to download the CLI and set that up and you should log in. I'll put some instructions somewhere nearby. And then we are going to use the Dfang generate command. Think of the generate command in Dfang similarly to templates in other systems where it gets you started, but you still have to write your own code after the fact. So this is going to use uh, AI to help you get up and running as fast as possible, but make sure to check out the code before you actually deploy anything. So we're gonna generate a simple chat room uh, using Express and Socket.io. So we do Dfang generate. I'm going to do Node.js because, well, that's what I wanna to build today. A simple Express app that uses socket IO to receive and rebroadcast messages for a chat room. Alrighty, so you'll see that Dfang has generated a project. It has opened it up in a new VS Code window and it's basically composed of a Docker Compose file, a Docker file, our main JavaScript file, and uh, package.json. So let's take a look at this. Yep, that makes sense to me. All request send path. That's kind of random. I'm gonna switch this up a little bit. I'm gonna do on message emit message, and here I'm gonna do name and message name and message. I don't know why this is here. I have a pre-made file we're gonna use as a very simple UI. We're gonna do that. And basically in here, we load up socket IO. We've got a very, very basic UI. And uh, yeah, we allow the user to send a message and we append messages as a list. So let's test that out locally first. NPM I. We also need to include path. And now we should be able to do that. And now we go to localhost 3000 and let's see. And Bob says, hello. And Jane says, what's up? And there we go. So we have our simple chat app running locally. We are going to RM RF node modules, and we're going to defang compose up. So defang compose up runs basically like Docker compose up. It'll build your images and get them up and running, except this is going to do it in the cloud. So now if we go to our portal at portal.defang.dev and we check on our services, we see this is Starting to build, you can hover your mouse over the little status symbol to see what's going on there. You can see service activating, the service is running, and soon it'll pass a couple health checks and we should be good to go. Awesome. So now if we go here and we add a split, we can do the same. And that's it. You've got your app up and running in Dfang in minutes. So check it out and hopefully we'll see you on the platform soon. See ya.